All right, welcome to the Apex Investing webinar for uh, Friday afternoon here. Uh, wrapping up a great week in trading. Um, first one was very profitable. I saw a lot of traders um, posting in our rooms this week how well they were doing on the trend catcher methods, on the five minute binary trend catcher methods, obviously on the Elite MVP. And I uh, really appreciate, you know, Kevin and Scott and Marilyn, you know, Lori, uh, you know, being in there like all the time. And, you know, just everybody who's been contributing to make this happen, um, you know, thank you so much for helping run those rooms. Um, it's it's really cool um, to have trained a bunch of traders that run the trade rooms and uh, voluntarily do so. So really appreciate everybody who, you know, spends their time in those rooms and traders that I've worked with and they've uh, built up and got to the confidence and funded the accounts and grown the accounts. And uh, I'm talking to a couple of them and they're, you know, they're upgrading now, they're doing been doing Nadex, but now they're upgrading to futures as well, and that's awesome. Just uh, you know, stepping up and uh, doing well. So uh, one thing I want to let you know is the toolkit is you know up and running. We have pushed out the trend catcher. Um, don't update it yet because you're going to do it again. Okay, so hold on one second before you go update it. Uh, or I get in this. Let me get through the announcements here, walk through everything with you. It's pretty simple. Uh, if you're, you know, we, what we've done is we've launched the five-minute binary trend catcher course. A lot of you already know what that is. You've either heard me talk about it on the Nadex webinars over the last couple weeks, or you've been inside of our, you know, Nadex binary trading pit or our elite trading room and seen the screens and, you know, all the, you know, conversations happening at night where Lori's been leading a lot of those trades. And uh, so... How do you do it? What are y'all been like? How do I get access to this? Well, you can get access right now, but I'd, I'd wait for just a minute just uh, you know, hear everything out. But uh, right here, you can click on subscribe, and you'll be able to get access to the um, Apex Essentials. We basically, um, you know, sort of upgraded P3, Apex Essentials, and Binary Trend Catcher. You just click right there, you get access to it. Now, if you're a futures or forex trader, obviously, you know, or a stock trader, CFD trader, etc. You're going to want the Apex Elite MVP and Trend Catcher. And we went ahead and made a list here of sort of what's included so you can see some of the differences. So there's a few more things obviously included uh, with the Elite MVP, such as the Elite MVP system and strategy, and a few additional indicators as well. So we listed them all out there for you so you can read that. A lot of people are like, well, what's the difference between the plans? Well, there's your cost, and here's what's included. Okay? Now, when you sign up, one thing that's really important is that you understand, like, you're going to live on a menu, okay? So if you're essentials, you're going to be really spending a lot of time right here on the essentials area, okay? If you're an elite member, you're going to spend a lot of time in the elite menu. That's where all your links are located, okay? So if you go right there to binary essentials, then you'll see you have access to your trade rooms. You have access to the trading pit, also to the elite room. Now, in the Elite Room, sometimes, you know, traders like, you know, Lori and other traders are sharing some of their five-minute binary charts during the day or at night. During the day, though, all the questions for binaries go inside the trading pit because we try to keep the Elite Room, you know, sort of focused on futures and forks, you know, some stocks, maybe some CFDs, spreads, etc. But all the binary questions in the day go in the trading pit. At night, it's a little bit mixed, okay? So, we, you know, the five-minute binary trades at night work really well. Um, so that, but that's going to be where you access your rooms. If you're elite, you have access to the exact same rooms right here. If you ever have access with the elite room, of course you have that hot comp support link and Kathy will take care of you. Okay. Now, what about how to trade them? If you go right down here, trading system courses, you'll see the five minute binary trend catcher course and the forum as well. Okay. So where you can you know post questions, of course, you can also post questions in the room. And we'll go through that course here in just a second. Also in Elite, we made sure we put it in both places for you. Okay, so Elite Trend Catcher courses. Here's the five minute binary course. Okay, right up here is the Elite Trend Catcher Futures Forks and Stock course. We're wrapping that up. Okay, again, we're wrapping that up. And let me see if I can give you a, a couple things. So you can save these links, okay? Let's see if this goes to everybody. 
Okay, so there's one link for you. And uh, I think everybody ought to be able to see that. It should have popped up in everybody's chat. If y'all can confirm that. Awesome. Okay. So that's the webinar I did on the 8th where I walked through the trend catcher. Okay. So I know some of y'all are for futures and forex in stock. So if y'all want to watch that and check that out and see, you know, so you can sort of get a head start while you're waiting on us to launch that course on Tuesday for the futures and forex, you can do that. Also, there's also even parameters already going up. And of course, we'll have trainings on this of tested out settings that traders are already using um, on the trend catcher. So already posted up in the forum. There's a new section under system in the forum. So questions, trading question forum. You just go over here to system. And you got trend catcher, five minute binaries, futures, forks, stock, also CFDs. Uh, okay. So that's basically where you can ask questions and you know where the courses are. So uh, let's go in here and let's walk through just this course real quick. I'm obviously not going to spend a lot of time on it. I just want to make sure you sort of know what's here. Um, you can talk about the live trade rooms. A lot of y'all already know about the live trade rooms. If you know the answers to a lot of these questions, you can answer them and go faster through the course. But there's some good little tips and tricks throughout that you might want to spend the time to, you know, go in and, you know, listen to the details there. Um, once you open the course up, watch the video. You click this, the video pops up, okay? If you want a fuller screen video, you can actually go over here and go to full screen. And if you want it to be, you know, if it's like not clear for you, you can actually choose to go in and increase the quality. Okay, like you can make it up to HD quality on the video. All right, a lot of people didn't know they could do that. They thought they had to stay inside the little window. You can make it full screen and you can increase the quality of the video. Okay, answer the questions. As soon as you do that, then what will happen is you'll have access to the next course. Okay, or the next unit in that course. So we talk about five minute binaries. I want to, and this is probably one of the best binary, it is the best binary course we've ever done. We make sure that everybody's on the exact same page, okay? And that, like, we even solve some questions, hop it up in the room. Some people are brand new, some people have been around a little, little bit, some confusion on some little things. I walk through all those little things. And it's sort of like a five minute binary course with a binary basics and details all wrapped up into one so you don't have to go to, 20 different places. Uh, we talk about, you know, setting up Nadex, setting up Ninja. If you have that done, you're obviously going to be able to answer those questions and not have to spend a lot of time there, okay? Uh, then we talk about how to set up your chart. We have templates already made and built in. Um, I then go into detail to explain each indicator on the chart. So it's not just this chart with like five things on it. So we show you how to set it up like quick, and then I slow down for a minute and I explain each thing. There's no quiz on this where I go into the indicators in detail. Just I know a lot of y'all want to know the details and what's behind it, what you're looking at. So I break it all down for you. Okay. Then we walk into how to find the binaries on the scanner. We talk about the difference between out of the money, at the money, in the money contracts. Okay. And you know which one you might want to choose and why whenever you're trading these contracts. Um, also, we go in here and then we give you the rules. What are the rules? There's two methods. There's basically three rules that apply to both methods, and then there's one confirmation that you need to happen, okay? And so I walk through that. This one right here, system one, is how to trade the flips on the trend catcher. System two is how to trade in between the flips, okay? Or method two. And then I talk about the dark zone and how late can you trade and, you know, some common questions like that. Um, then I go into submitting it, and I just sort of go over the scanner. I go through little details, little tips and tricks, things that will help you out a lot. And then we just wrap up with, you know, survey. Okay? So it's pretty simple. Spend the time, go through it, knock it out this weekend, get it out of the way, and, I mean, you'll be ready to rock and roll. Okay? These things trade 23 hours a day. And they're, like, it's, <laughs> they're a whole lot of fun. Okay? So definitely check that out. That comes, of course, with, you know, Elite or, you know, Essentials um, as well. Now, one of the things that when we were upgrading the code, it was such a massive upgrade that, like, like in, in the sense of much better, like we rewrote a lot of the code to make Trendcatcher work because there's so much going on behind the scenes, okay, um, that Spike Striker is not compatible with the code. 
So right now, there's an unknown ETA. And if you're asking questions, I promise I'm going to answer them, okay? There's an unknown ETA of when Spike Striker will be available. So the only way you can really get access to it, okay, is if you roll back your toolkit. Now, one thing, you know, just to let you know, I mean, Spike Striker is about volume spikes. Who out there thinks there's been just an insane amount of volume lately? Like a lot of volume. Does everybody agree there's been a lot of volume, no matter what you're trading? So if there is just a whole lot of volume, how effective do you think a spike in volume is going to be? Do you think it's as effective as when you get spikes in like lower and mid volatility markets? When volume is just going crazy everywhere? So I just, I'm trying to bring this up to you as a, a reality check. And I mean, if you looked at Spike Striker, you know, okay? So it's, it's been, it has had a rough time. Like you don't really even see like 10 and 15 minute ones because there's five minute ones everywhere. Um, so would you rather have an indicator that, you know, is one that you get a few signals a day, maybe four, maybe 10 signals in a day, you're waiting on it, all that, that is better for lower medium volatility markets? Or would you rather have something that could be traded 23 hours a day and you, you could potentially have a trade almost every single five minutes? So which one sounds better to you? Okay, so obviously you got to make that choice, but I can tell you what I've been looking at, <laughs> and it hasn't been Spike Striker. So we have it on our to-do list, but it's literally like it's a massive, massive rewrite. Okay, and I promise you, five-minute binaries so much better. The trick catcher course so much better than Spike Striker. Um, so if you upgrade your toolkit, it's gonna put trick catcher on there. Spike Striker won't work. I just want to let everybody know, so we're not getting a thousand ticks about why Spike Striker is not working. Right now, you don't want it anyway because the volume is just going crazy. Um, so, yeah, 23 hours from 6 p.m. to 5 p.m. Um, all right, so now if you're not a paying member and you want to get access right now, again, just click on these links, sign up, get access. If you're just a you know, free member, enjoying all the free education, that's awesome. You can check it out, 7 bucks for two weeks, okay? Now, one of the questions came up, well, what if I'm an active member? What if I signed up six months ago? What if I signed up last week? Do I still get access? The answer is yes. Here's what we're doing, okay? And we talked about this a little bit on last Thursday's webinar. But what we're doing is we're actually going to give you a link, and I'm going to give it to you right now, okay? Right here. This will only work if you're currently an active elite or P3 day trading plan member. This link will only work because you're already a paying member, okay? So if you go here, it's going to be like, all red text if you're not a current elite or p3 member if you're already if you signed up like last night we've already had some people sign up because the links were going up then they already have access like right now okay so that link right there is going to get you access to trend catcher right now if you're already a paying member now trend catcher is not a upgrade to the apex pattern or to volume or to range it it is its own system okay so what we're gonna do is that 30-day trial link that i just gave you gives you three options okay one is well actually there's three options to what you want to do after 30 days but you get access free for 30 days with your active paid membership okay at no cost because you're already you're already paying all right so we give you a free 30-day trial to check it all out you click on that, it'll activate Trend Catcher, update your toolkit to the latest version, and you will have access, okay, for free for 30 days. What happens after 30 days? Well, if you do nothing, then the Trend Catcher trial will expire, and your plan will stay the exact same with, say, like, you know, P3 signals and the day trading plans, or with Elite MVP and the day trading plans. So you may have three plans, you know, you're a monthly paying member, or you may have like eight plans, you're an upgraded member, maybe you have eight plans because you're an annual member and you're getting a massive discount annually. You can keep that. You don't have to use this, okay? I love it. I think you're going to like it a lot, okay? So check it out. It's not going to cost you a thing. But there, there is no obligation on what you have to do, okay? So understand that. Like if, if you sign up for the trial, nothing's going to happen at the end of the 30 days except for it just won't work after 30 days. 
okay, if you don't do anything. Does everybody understand that? Like, there's no obligation when you sign up for the free trial, and you don't have to change your plan. Okay? Now, the other thing you could do is you could add on the trend catcher to your existing membership, meaning like elite plus the day trading plans or essentials plus the day trading plans, or maybe you're an annual member with a big discount and you got that promotion we did when we first launched the day trading plans. If you want to keep those day trading plans, which I mean, we have members that love them. They want to keep, we have members that are like, I just much rather do trend catcher. Okay. If you want to keep those plans and you want to add Trend Catcher on, again, it's an add-on. It's its own system. Notice this: the Elite MVP and Trend Catcher doesn't include day trading plans. Okay, it's a separate subscription. All right, remember that was a limited promotion. If you want to keep those, then you can add it on for $100. Just submit a help desk ticket, and we'll get you the link before the end of the 30 days to be able to add it on for $100. Some of you are like, you know, I'd rather just have the trend catcher. I've seen these five-minute binaries. I've seen these one, two, three thousand dollar profits happening inside the elite room on uh, day after day on futures trades. I would just rather switch over to trend catcher. I don't want to use the day trading plans. If that's you, submit. Just go in and go to questions. Okay. Questions help desk. Okay, help desk. Submit a new ticket and just say, hey. I would rather have trend catcher over day trading plans and we'll take care of it. Okay. In the back end, we'll take care of that. You'll get access to trend catcher at zero additional cost and not have the day trading plans. So you can choose which one you want to do. You can say, Hey, I want to keep, I like it how it is. I don't want to change a thing. Fine. That's choice. A choice B. Hey, I want everything hundred dollars more. Okay. Per month or C um, I don't want to raise my cost. I want the trend catcher. I'm not I'm not really using the day trading plans as much as I thought I would. I'm more into the five minute binaries or I'm more into the elite MVP or I want the trend catcher itself or trading futures in Forex. So just go ahead and switch me over. So A do nothing, B add on, or C switch over. Okay? Any of those three are available for you. You can choose whichever one you would like to do. Okay, we're not forcing you. We just want to put those options out there without making you upgrade, but also giving you the ability to do so or giving you the ability to switch over if you don't want to pay anything more and you want to get access. All right. Uh, everybody ha should have the link. Everybody have the link to sign up. Did that come through okay? I want to make sure first on that, and then I'm going to go through. I'm going to answer all the questions that have been being posted. Did everybody get that link to sign up? Okay. Everybody got it. Sweet. <laughs> I just want to make sure everybody's on the same page. Uh, if that link's not working for you, it means you're not currently an active paying P3 or Elite MVP day trading plan member. Okay, so like, let's say you signed up last night for the Elite MVP and Trend Catcher. You already got Trend Catcher. You're set. It's active right now. If you reinstall your toolkit and open up Ninja, it will work right now. Okay. Uh, so one question, if I already paid 147 for the month, is this included? So yes, it is included because we're giving you the 30 day trial. If you decide you, you know, I'm not even using those plans, switch me over. Then there's no additional cost. You just let us know that you'd rather have trend catcher and you're all set. Okay. Um, let me see here. Ernesto, if I'm trading Nadex, is trend catcher working well with trading indices? If so, using binaries or spreads or trading Nadex, should I just stick with the current five minute binaries? Uh, we do have some traders. Lori actually did a webinar last week on 20-minute binaries um, using Trend Catcher. Um, personally, watch this five-minute course, Ernesto, and you are going to see why. They move really fast, short trades. You're in, you're done, you're out within a minute or two. I mean, literally, I was just recording examples, and I'm like, okay, boom, it's a buy. Boom, buy. Hit the price, like, within a minute or two. Like, 20 bucks, 20 bucks, 20 bucks. Uh Try the five-minute binaries and see what happens. Now, I'm not saying you can't do the 20 minutes also. It's a whole different application, though. This five-minute binary course was made for five-minute binaries. It wasn't made for spreads. It wasn't made for futures or forks or CFDs. It wasn't made for 20-minute binaries, hourly binaries, daily or weekly binaries. It was made for five-minute binary contracts, okay? Because the settings and everything are built on this. this is, these are trades that people are doing right now every day, and we're you know 
They're very, very happy with the results. So obviously, we're going to tell you to go demo trade it. You make sure you're happy before you uh, put you know live risk capital and make your own trading decisions. But I would stick with the five-minute binaries for now. And um, who knows? They may add five-minute indice binaries in the future. So, uh, but literally, like, when a person comes in going forward and they're like, I'm new, where should I start? I'm going to send them right to five-minute binary contracts because they're going to get a ton of practice. Works well, simple, low risk, easy. I mean, it's like get up and running fast with minimal capital. Okay? Um, obviously, if somebody comes in and they want to trade futures, I'm going to send them to Trend Catcher and Elite MVP. As you all know, if you've taken the course, you went through it, it takes a little time to learn. It's not that it's really hard, but you're sitting there, you're watching, you're waiting. So, five minute binders is something you can actually do in between. Um, so when did I say the course would be available? It should be available for everybody right now. Like literally, you should be able to go directly to your essentials or elite section, okay? And go down to the courses and you'll see five minute binary trend catcher course. So it should be active for everybody right now at the moment. Let's see here, scrolling on down. What if I'm on a trial membership expiring tomorrow? Uh, well, when it expires, you can sign right back up on the homepage for the Elite Essentials Binary Trend Catcher, or you can just email us and say, hey, I want to go ahead and just flip over. Okay? So either way you'd like to do that, you can do it either way. Um, so, but the course is not out yet. It should be out right now. Um, for the binaries. Now, what about for the futures and forex? Well, that's one of the reasons I gave you the link from the webinar I did a couple weeks ago, where I walked through it. That's also the reason I gave you the parameters. So if you want to start checking it out right now, and we're talking a few days. Like, it'll be done on Tuesday, but if you want to play with it this weekend, activate it. You know, you're welcome to. Um, if you're a futures and forex only, you know, trader or stock trader, or, you know, CFD trader, you want to wait, you can wait for that course to come out. Uh, you're welcome to do that, but you may want to download it, get it installed, you know, all that fun stuff. Get that knocked out this weekend. Um, if you can't get the link right now, how will you be able to get it? Uh, just put a help desk ticket in. You said you're on your phone. Go in, just go to questions, okay? And then go to help desk and just submit a ticket requesting the link, okay? So, if you, again, you only get that link if you're an active Elite or P3 or Day Trading Plan member. So, and I know you are, um, but I'm just saying, you know, for other people that may be watching the recording. So, if you didn't get that link, you can do that right there, okay? And uh, let's see here as well. Let me see if I can find. The link is actually pretty simple. <laughs> I mean, it's not like a secret code or anything. Um, you have to sign in first, all right, sign in, and then go to the link. It's just apexinvesting.net forward slash member forward slash sign up forward slash TC promo, okay? Um, so that way I've read it out loud so if you're watching. Again, apexinvesting.net forward slash member forward slash sign up forward slash TC trend catcher promo. And that's for those of you who want to check it out that have the day trading plans. Um... Let's see here. I don't get how Trend Catcher works with day trading plans or does not work with it. Does one complement the other? Uh, Trend Catcher, as far as like looking at you know bigger scale futures forex trades, it's not the same thing. So you actually you know you can actually get more trades uh, you know, depending upon the day on either one. Um, what you are going to get with Trend Catcher is you're going to get instant stats. So make sure you watch that YouTube video I posted because I actually show you what it is and how it works. Okay. Um, and let me see here. Let me pull up one thing for you because I know you're asking more about the. Um, let me see. Give me one second and see if this will work for me. If it does, then I might be able to give you a couple examples real quick.
So right over here, if we go to Trend Catcher, Scott's been putting up a bunch of the different you know posts that he's you know been doing. And so as an example, um, he went in. He had is over a few month period um, expectancy of 15 ticks. This is on the Dow. Okay, 15 ticks per trade, meaning wins and losses combined, 15 ticks. Number of trades, not that many, 67. A um, little less than a 50%, you know, loss to win, you know, win to loss ratio. Profit, though, was much higher. Made 72 ticks on average, lost 25, when he was profitable, lost 25 ticks on average when he was not. Made 1,000 ticks overall. The Dow is five bucks a tick, so that's five grand. Um, and on 67 trades, so a few hundred dollars in commissions. Max drawdown was 193 ticks. Okay? So about $1,000 drawdown, $5,000 profit. That's one example. How does it work? It's pretty pretty simple, pretty cut and dry. Uh, and I'll be making all the trainings and I go through it. But uh, the best way I can put it for you is you see a cyan arrow. Okay? And then it looks at what's called confirmation, which means it's actually checking the trend catcher on another, on actually a time frame, on a different time frame, to see if it's lining up. So that's why you don't see it taking longs right here. So cyan is, hey, hey set up our trend catcher. It's looking like it's going to flip. If it hits this offset price, we're going short. It does flip. It goes short. We get in. So we're in right there at 17519 on that trade. And then... We start trailing our stop. Literally, we put our stop right at the high of the cyan bar, okay? And then we trail it with the trend catcher line. And then if the trend catcher flips, we get out of the trade. Like, those are the rules. Cyan bar hits offset price, the confirmation, okay? Go short, put your stop. Nice, tight stops, okay? And then boom, 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 going down. And then it trails it, and it flips. Like that, like that's it. it like that's it, okay? Um, over here, here's oil. Oil on a six-tick expectancy. Made two thousand, about 2,000 ticks. I'm rounding here. Uh, at $10 a tick, that's a lot. <laughs> that's 20 grand. Uh, so, is that right? Two, th yeah. So $20,000 in profit over the last few months. 315 trades. Had 114 tick drawdown, so about an 1,100 drawdown with a $20,000 profit. Uh, again, win win loss ratio wasn't great, but the risk management's really tight. Average loss 11 ticks, average win 33 ticks. So looking at making about six six ticks, 60 bucks each time you do a trade. Okay, and obviously you need to subtract commissions. So if I say okay, profits was 1962. I had 315 trades. Let's say I pay four dollars in commissions. That's 1,200. 1,200 minus 20 grand. I'm looking at about you know 18,000 something dollars in profit over a few months. Trading just one. That's just one oil contract. That's not compounding. That's not taking some of those profits and increasing your size. Staying consistent with that one contract. And these stats are spit out automatically. There's actually a parameter setting inside of the trend catcher indicator itself. You can literally just copy and paste, and that's I really, really appreciate Scott hopping in there and doing this for everybody. Thank you so much. Uh, but I mean, he's been—I don't know how many hours him and Kevin and Lori and Marilyn and all of them just like just an insane amount of hours that they've spent just putting all these different pieces together. Um, and just what you do is you go in, and it's like CLs. Okay, so open a CL chart. Make the diagnostic bars 12 ticks. Right click on the chart. You know, add your trend catcher, add the trend catcher confirmation. And inside of trend catcher itself, there are several parameter sections. There's like one there. There's one there. But the one you care about, okay, and we'll talk about all the details in the training, is right here. So you, if you copy that and paste that right there, then you can add the exact same settings on your chart. So as long as you've got an oil 12 tick chart open, copy and paste those parameters in there, you get instant stats. They pop right up, okay? Like you saw in the picture. So it's instant stats. You can actually make it even show the trades. Um, and there's even a box up here where you can make it export the entire trade report. 
like every single trade, every entry, every exit, break it down by hour, and you can literally see what hours are best, worst, etc. You can basically modify the entire thing to your trading schedule. Uh, so pretty cool. Um, you know, there's NASDAQ with four tick expectancy, um, the S&P with three and a half, uh, dollar yen with four, uh, dollar or pound yen with, you know, five tick expectancy, Russell with five tick expectancy, gold with six tick, six tick expectancy. You know, you can go through, you can check them all out and, uh, you know, we'll add more as you find settings. So after we do the course and everything, as you find settings, add more to it. You know, we want this to be a thing where everybody's coming together and, uh, you know, basically learning from one another and sharing, you know, that's the whole idea of Apex is it's traders helping traders. Um, now, as far as it goes with day trading plans, does it complement it? The one application that uh, you may want to check out literally is the hardest part of day trading plans for most traders is trailing their stops. So I would say that's probably the number one most difficult thing is like, where do I, how do I trail? to go for that target two, three, four, five, so I can get those bigger profits. Well, if you put these on diagnostic bars, it cleans the charts up a lot on the day trading plans. And then if you use the trend catcher with it, you could use that to trail your stops. So, you know, hey, I'm in, I got my initial stop loss. Instead of using the big stop, I use the high of the diagnostic bar. If I went short, you know, as a down close right there on the entry line. And then I literally just trail with that trend catcher. And uh, when it flips, I hop out of the, the day trading plan. So that's the simplest and best way. Um, now, I also know traders that'll have, you know, elite MVP up, they'll have day trading plans up, they'll have trend catcher up, and when everything lines up, I mean, they're they're going full throttle. <laughs> so, um, and the trend catcher is based on the immediate trend in the market. So it's not, I mean, it may catch, I mean, sometimes we literally catch, like, the other day, I was just showing some stuff in the room, um, Debra's been with us for a while. She was in there. She's been doing fantastic. And she's like, yeah, I just made $2,300 on oil. Live trading right there. Um, it's it's just the immediate trend. So it may catch, I mean, literally like a $2 move. It may catch, you know, 10 ticks, 30 ticks, you know. Uh, but it, there's a lot behind it. <laughs> so the bottom line is it's, it's meant to catch the immediate trend and the price action of the market. Um, I mean, without... I mean, we, we literally spent eight weeks and probably about 100 hours a week, literally, just getting it coded, okay? Um, and so, just to give you an idea, like, I mean, how many weeks you got for me to explain it to you? Because it's not, it's, it's not a simple, it's, it's not simple. <laughs> There's a lot to it. Um, what would you suggest in the following situation? Um, I have valid long signal on day trading point on CL, and the same time I see a short signal on CL on trend catcher during my long position trend on CL. I don't I don't use trend catcher to filter day trading plans. I use it only to trail. Okay. Um. I so and it's not just because you have a short on it. You actually have to have a confirmed short, a confirmed long. So and that's part of what I'll go over in the course as well. And I went over some of that also last um. Thursday in that webinar I posted up. Let's see. If you switch over to day trading plans to trend catcher, um, do you get three indices free on day trading plans? No. <laughs> um, so if you, if you switch over, you get all markets on day trading plans. I'm sorry, all markets on trend catcher because day trading plans are manually entered. All markets on trend catcher. So you basically could have like the few markets, the three markets you got or the eight markets you got. If you, you know, you annual member, you put in the discounted rate on just three markets or eight markets, or you can get day trading plans with instant stats on all markets. So unless you want to pay for the add-on of $100 a month. Remember, that's option B. So option A, do nothing. Trend catcher expires. Option B, add it. So you can add it to your membership if you currently have it, okay? But you'd have to currently be an Elite or P3 member. It doesn't go backwards. Um, so basically, the only people who are grandfathered in are people who are current members, um, current subscribers. So, or C, choose to switch over. Um, does trend catch work with every, in every instrument or is it mainly for five-minute binaries? John, that's a great question. Um, 
these are two completely different applications of the system, okay? So, and I probably answered that already for you, I guess, right here. But, I mean, this is on futures and forex, and, I mean, you could load up stocks as well. It's a different system. So, like, the rules that I teach in the five-minute course have nothing to do with trading futures or forex or stocks, okay? It's completely different. Um, it's very active. Basically, got three rules. You got one confirmation. You go with it. We trade the flips. We trade in between the flips. We're in and out, like, every few minutes trading five-minute binary contracts, okay? So there is an application of it. And I mean, we're only using three tick bars, like literally really, really small tick bars for very, very fast price action. We're literally just trying to have the market move a couple ticks, put up 20 bucks for risk, make 20 bucks, boom. And literally in like one or tick move, one, like one or two tick move. Um, so it's, I mean, it's pretty cool risk reward wise if you think about like, you know, the risk you put up trading Forex and stuff like that. But, uh, and with the cap risk on it. I mean, it's worth watching the course and checking it out. But it definitely does apply to futures and forks and stocks, but that's where the stats come in, okay? Um, which brings me to my next point real quick that I wanted to bring up is the stats are for trading futures, for trading forks, for trading stocks, okay? They're not for trading binary options. They're not really even for trading spreads because – they're not factoring in premium, the additional bid offer that you pay when you trade an option, and, the, and a variety of expirations and strikes. That's literally getting in the trade and getting out of the trade without regard to strikes, premiums, expirations. You know, I mean, a binary contract you could buy and you could hold on to the thing and pop back up. I mean, it's just it's totally different. So the stats will not give you even a reasonable clue on what would happen on a binary contract by trying to use the stat engine. If you hop in and watch the five-minute course, you'll see real quick what happens, okay? It doesn't take a whole lot. Um, so uh, the rules are it basically it's different, but um, you can use it on both. It's just it's two completely different ones. Like we're using, like, say, you know, 12 ticks on oil, or if you go down, like, to the US yen and stuff like that down here, uh, we got 14 ticks on dollar yen. Well, we're using three ticks on dollar yen when we trade five-minute binary contracts. So it's literally just a different world. And we have people that are literally already trading both. So they're going in or, you know, and they they got futures up. And while they're waiting, because, I mean, you may get eight signals in a day, you may get one. Because it has to confirm and line up and everything else. What do you do in the rest of the time? While you're sitting there and waiting. Um, let's see. Question, can I add day trading plans back at a later time? Um, yes, that is, yeah, I mean, as long as we offer anything, you can always add it back on. So I don't know what the cost will be in the future. Less, more, whatever. Um, you know, who knows where we'll go as we keep growing. So, but, you know, anything we have available, obviously, yes, you can add back on. But what the price will be, I don't know. Uh, I, <laughs> I'm just trying to make this as easily available to you as possible. Um, let's see here. Yeah, you have to be signed in. Right. You have to be signed in for the link to work. That is correct. Um, does the five-minute trend catcher course apply to 20-minute binaries? There actually is a webinar after you've done this, okay? The better answer to that question is because honestly, Lori's been doing more of the 20 minutes. I haven't had time because I've been so busy working on this during the day. I've just been hopping back and forth, and they're only available during the day. But there is a webinar under education, webinar recordings. I want to say newest webinars where Lori went into five and 20-minute binaries right there. Yep, January 17th. And she talked about the application. I, have, I haven't traded it on 20 minutes yet but she has and she does it all the time so um and she volunteers to trade she comes in and trades and shares her charts and everything she spends a lot of time helping people out uh, let me see here let me see if i can post this link over to you okay just to make it easier to get to but it was under education webinars newest webinars right there so if you want to watch that webinar that traders helping traders webinar 
um, that she did where she talked about five and 20 minutes, that would probably be the best way to answer your question because I don't want to just jump in and say anything. Like I, I actually still need to catch up with her on it. Um, but she said it, it acts very similar in 20 minutes. Um, do you have templates for both? Okay, uh, we already have templates for the five-minute binary contracts. So as you go through the course, we'll actually show you that. But basically, and trust me, you need to go through the course. If you don't go through the course, you're just wasting time and money, okay? But yes, you can go to the templates, you can go to load, and there is a binary trend catcher three tick chart, okay? So that's already set up for the five minute binary contracts. You honestly don't need a template for the other ones. You need parameters to help you get started fast, but you don't need a template. Because I mean, you right click and you add two indicators and you're done. Okay, I mean, it's, it's that simple, okay? Uh, like there, it's not like there's some massive setup process. So the hardest part is figuring out the settings. And like I said, we're making that course to break that all down for you and make it simple. Um, let's see here. What else do we got? Uh, let's see, Ed. Uh, what question? Oh, your question was answered. Okay. Um, so, yeah, when you install the toolkit, there is a template. Yeah, we're just showing, just answering the same question there. Uh, just asked twice. So, but again, if you'll please watch the course, okay? I mean, you want to make money doing it? Your, your probability goes higher when you watch this course, okay? I know nobody likes to watch courses, you know, but it's worth it. Like I've, I've never spent so much time <laughs> literally on a course and trying to make sure that I front around every question possible that I could think of. <laughs> so basically, cause I, I wanted to make sure that I answered all the questions I could. And that's why we, that was part of the big benefit of having the beta that we have a beta team. They test it out. We get a lot of questions. We try a lot of things out. We got a lot of those questions out of the way up front. Um, what is meant by trend catcher confirmation and trend catcher simulator? Uh, trend catcher confirmation, obviously we're gonna go over all this in that, but if you watch that YouTube video, you'll actually, if you'll go back out and watch that first link I posted, let me post it for you again, okay? Um, let's see here. I actually show you confirmation, I show you the simulator, but what happens Oh, wait a minute, that's the wrong spot. There we go. Um, and let me go back over here to see if I can find, go back down to Trend Catcher, and I can show you what I mean specifically. Or I can just open a chart and show you. Uh, but it just takes a few minutes, as you know, <laughs> to open these diagnostic charts up. Um, let's see here. There is, I'm trying to, I think it's hiding behind my code webinar stuff. Hold on. There we go. Let me move this over. Go to file, new, chart. And right here, if I want to pull up, you know, whatever specific instrument, um, so we'll pick one of Scott's over here. We'll go in here. Find the settings down here. Let's see. Let's go in and, let's, you know, we can grab that one. Um, that one actually looks short, Scott. You might want to check that to make sure. I don't think all the settings are there. You, you have the, like, I think that's the first settings, not the, the big ones with the schedule in it, unless it's just really that, that simple. Um, yeah, let's see. I think he needs to update that. Let me copy and paste. All right, well, we'll go with oil. All right, so right here, we go in, and we'll change this to oil. Okay, so we're on the March contract. It said 12 tick bar, so let's say we're looking at 12 ticks, so we'll add that. 12 ticks, and load it up. Give that a minute to load up, and let's see here. 
that shouldn't take too long. Um, the basic summary of what is meant by simulation and confirmation. Simulation is actually going to plot all the trades on the chart. It's going to make an Excel sheet that where you can export all the trades. It's going to show you the profit and loss by half hour. It's going to get you all the statistics, okay? Um, whereas confirmation is, hey, I got a trend catcher on 12 tick bars. Do I also have a trend catcher on 10 minute bars in the same direction? Do I have two different things telling me the same thing? That's what confirmation is about. So confirmation is actually going to confirm with a time frame if the trend catcher is winding up. If it is, then it'll say, hey, we can take this trade. And that will, you know, anytime you're on diagnostic bars, it takes longer, but it's worth it. Um, let's see. Will NADX be increasing the bid offer size? Um, okay, yeah, just the size the quantity size uh, to keep up. I, I actually have heard that they will be, but they need to hear from us. So if you're trading them, then email customer service at .com and say, Hey, let's get serious. Get us some more size. The reality is, I mean, they're every five minutes on four markets. So it's really 120 contracts, uh, you know, combined and it's every five minutes and they refresh in like 30 seconds. So unless somebody's sitting there, like everybody's trading all at the exact same time in the exact same five minutes, Stumbling over each other really hasn't been a big issue. Obviously, as it grows, yeah, they're going to add size. So, um, all right, so we go over there, we come in here, and we go down to trend catcher, trend catcher confirmation, and I go over here, and Paste the settings. Hit apply. Let's see if I can tell inside. You don't have to know how to do what I'm doing right now, but direction, settings, period, smoothing, volatile, volatile, volatile. Confirmation true, confirmation, settings. What we got here? We got 15, 1, 5, 2. Okay. All right. So confirmation bars, period. It's 15, 1, 5, 2. I haven't made the course on this, so I'm trying to jump ahead for you here. I think that's right, but... Um, what it's going to do is it's going to plot the confirmation. I'm actually going to see the red and green down here. And that's plotting the 10 minutes. So I don't have to have two charts open at one time. Okay. So it plots that up. Here's all the trend catcher trades just taken by themselves. I can then go in here. Now you have to be an elite day trading plan member. Okay. In order to use the stats. Okay. Um, because obviously they're not, they're not for binaries. Because they don't take into account expiration, strikes, things like that. So it, it's made for futures and forex traders. The stats are made for futures and forex traders. Uh, but anyway, so you go into the indicator. If you're an elite member, then you can turn them on. And you can go in. You can turn on right up here. One, there's the simulator. Okay. If I hit that button, then what it'll do is it'll actually plot all the trades. Let's see that blue lines right there? It's plotting the trades that were taken. And if I turn the stats on, It'll actually give me the stats on the trade. Yeah, I know I messed up a setting on there. But uh, but right in here, what it'll do is it'll give you the stats on the trade. And then you can go and you can export the report. And literally open it up in Excel. And it will show you every single trade. Okay, so step by step, every trade that took place, I'm dragging it across all my screens here, like eight screens. Um, so right here we got every single trade that took place, date, time, entry price, exit price, P&L ticks, what settings were used on it, 
And then if we go back here to performance, then we can actually see, you can break it down and say, you know, show me the profitable hours. I don't want to see the hours that lost three ticks and four ticks. I only want these right here. Click OK. Um, obviously, I don't want the zero hours. And this shows me the hours where it was most profitable. So this is trading right here basically between 9.30 and 12. Shows me how many, what's the average ticks, what's the average tick win, average tick loss, what the total ticks made or lost during that hour, what's the maximum drawdown in ticks for that half hour, if you just took that half hour and that's it on that day of the week. So it's literally breaking it down by day of the week for you. What this actually shows you is don't trade on Friday, on will, <laughs> um, for these specific settings. So overall, you know, it'll show you, you know, total ticks profit, max drawdown in ticks, number of trades, etc. Again, I'm jumping ahead on the gun here because we haven't made, haven't, we've actually outlined the entire course, we just haven't completed it. Um, so, I mean, probably going to, you know, hold off a little bit there before you dive right in. Um, let's see here, does, what do we got here? Well, uh, we got that. Elite Trend Catcher course will start on Tuesday. That's when it will be up for the Forex and Futures, like Tuesday afternoon, evening there, by 5 o'clock or sooner, okay? Um, does the trial time period activate when you sign up? For example, I can't trade for the next five days. will be 30 days from the time I sign up. Yes, it will be. So, and right now, it's 30 days. So, here in like 10 days, we're going to make it a 20-day trial period. So, it's 30 days from now. So, you want to go ahead and you want to activate that trial period. Uh, even if you can't trade, maybe you can watch, you know, the courses, things like that, get stuff set up. Um, but I mean, if you wait till, you know, Tuesday, it's not going to hurt you. Um, let's see now. I mean, if you're now, if you're trading binaries at all, like hop on there and get it down. So you're ready. If we, uh, switch to day trading plans, can we add back or if we switch over to trading catcher? Can we add that trading trading plans later? Um, yes. So, I mean, that's all I can say. Uh, as far as what the cost will be, I don't know. Um, uh, I got in on the day trading plan special. If I switch over, will my price be 200 or 147? Uh, depends upon what special you got in on. If you got in on P3, that'd be 147. If you got it, I, uh, if you're an elite member, it'd be 200 because you do get more with elite. You get the simulator, you get the stats, you get the MVP. You get, I mean, there's like there's a whole list. So basically, whatever your monthly rate is now, if you're a monthly member, uh, whatever your monthly rate is now. Now, if you're an annual member and you switch over, there's no additional cost. Um, let's see here. It often uh, hyperlinks do not work inside of go to webinar, so you have to Skype it to me. Um, let's see here going uh, down. Does the elite member have to register for the trial? Yes, you need to go to that link that I gave there earlier. If you want to access it, if you're already a paying elite MVP member, not an elite MVP, like MVP and day trading plan member then yes, you want to go to this link right now, or if you're paying Elite P3 and Day Trading Plan member, then go to that link right there, that sign up, apexinvesting.net forward slash member forward slash sign up forward slash TC promo, and you can activate it right away. Uh, if you are an Elite member that signed up after I guess you said, like say in the last 12 to 24 hours, you already had the trend catcher. So you're set up, you're active. Like your the your subscription should literally say Elite MVP and Trend Catcher. If you go look at your current subscriptions under Questions Subscriptions, right there. But if you're not sure, you want to ask specifically on your account, then um, just pop in the the help desk and we'll we'll let you know. But uh, but if you're a member who doesn't have trade plans, no, I mean it'll, it'll be activated for you. Just you know, ask if you don't think it is, but it, it may be. Um, 
Let's see here. Let's see, that should be working, 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 working. Um, all right, Austin, I'll get with you afterwards. We'll check that out. Um, how is the binary trend catcher different from the regular trend catcher? The binary trend catcher is made for five minute binaries that expire every five minutes. They need to move one or two ticks, maybe three ticks for you to make profit and you're done. Okay? Like that is the trade. And it's on three tick bars. The regular trend catcher is literally going in and it's taking futures, forex, stock, CFD trades. There's no premium, there's no expirations. We're just getting in, we're following the trend, we're getting out, we're trading volatile to the market. It's, it's, it's two completely different instruments. And the system is completely different, like 14 tick bars versus three tick bars. Every five minutes versus, you know, a few trade, like one, two, three trades maybe in a day or three trades in a week. You just never know how many they're going to be. Um, I'm a pre through member. I'm paying 147 after three days, free trial. How much more do I need to pay? Uh, you can pay nothing at all uh, and get the trend catcher and just say, hey, I want trend catcher instead of day trading plans. If you want to keep the day trading plans that you have with P3, then you can pay $100 more. So, or you can choose to, you know, just keep the different points and not have the trend catcher. So you're you're gonna want it, especially if you're a P3 member. That means you trade binaries. So uh, if you want to add a mod, it's 100 bucks more, or you can just switch it out and it costs you nothing to get it. Okay. Um, let's see here. Um, not quite sure what labels you're talking about, Kelly. Um, are the trend catcher courses up and ready and can we take the course over the weekend yeah again <laughs> the five minute binary trend catcher course is up and ready the futures and forks and stock trend catcher course will be up by Tuesday um, so it doesn't matter Kelly <laughs> it's, we're okay um, do we get out when the cyan arrow comes? I'm not quite sure what you're asking, Barat, in relation to what. If you're talking about the futures and forex course, you get out when the trend catcher flips. Not the cyan arrow. Because cyan means possible flip. So at that red or green arrow would be you'd be getting out if you were taking a future contract. Can I explain drawdown? Drawdown is maximum peak to valley. So let's say I got in. And I got in at the worst possible time to start trading this system. And I caught like the worst drawdown it had from as high as it went to as low as it went. That's max drawdown. So let's say I had a 200 tick drawdown. That means I caught it up at one level and it literally came down 200 ticks from that point. So I had a 200 tick drawdown. So I should plan to have... Ideally, three to four times, ideally, the um, max drawdown in a system in my account at a minimum per contract I trade. So that we have money for margin, money for, you know, max drawdown doesn't mean it can't get larger in the future. So, you know, you want to have some extra, you know, powder there in the gun. Uh, but drawdown just basically means how low did it go from its maximum peak in the equity curve. So I start with five grand, seven grand, nine grand, twelve grand, down to nine grand. Okay, that's a three thousand dollar drawdown. How do you break down stats for small time frames? Um, if you open the Excel sheet, then you can see them by thirty minute increments by day of the week. Beyond that, you'd have to. If you want to do anything beyond that, that'd be. That's as small as it gets. 30 minute time frames by day of the week. Uh, and it's in Excel, so you're welcome to manipulate that Excel data in any way you want to. Uh, you know, you can add in formulas and all that stuff and, you know, play with it. And I mean, there's, you can get as fancy as you want with it. We give you the data, what you want to do with it from there, as far as if you want to break it down by day of the month and all that stuff, then um, you just have to extract the formulas. So you just have to write the formulas in Excel to do all that if you, you know, if you want to go there. Um, what time in the morning do five minute binary start trading? They start trading at six p.m. in the evening and they go till five p.m. the next day. They trade for twenty three hours. 
Uh, when you are talking about trend catcher, are you meaning both binary trend catcher and futures? There's two different ones. So it's the same indicator, but it's used in completely different ways. How does it work with the Apex system? It's great. It gives you, it can give you a tighter trailing stop. It can give you earlier confirmation on an E. You get the Apex, the MVP, you know, trend catcher all lining up. I mean, that's triple confirmation. So a uh, big thing is you can tighten up the trailing stops faster. And you can even use tighter stops with it lining up. Uh, all right. A uh, common question here. If all the Apex members, because we have like 10,000 of them, um, are using trend catcher and entering the same trades, does that reduce the win rate? It actually would advance your trade because that means a whole lot of people are buying up the market. Uh, also, 10,000 retail traders, I mean, there's not even 10,000, there's 10,000 free members, um, are not going to be what moves the market. I mean, I, that, that'd be awesome, but it's not. Uh, and they're not all going to be trading the exact same markets. They're not all going to be taking the exact same trades or trading different schedules, different markets, to be trading different settings. No, it's, that's one of those like things that everybody brings up that I've never seen it impact anybody anywhere before. Anywhere. Um, the market's just, it's, it's bigger than that. Now, if we all hopped in on gold, you know, the exact same time, and we all hit the button right then, yeah, gold small enough that, you know, what would happen? Bye, 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 bye. It just it pushed the market. Um, what's interesting, a diagnostic bar and a range bar? A range bar is the number of ticks from high to low that a bar must move. So it could move down, if it's a 10 tick range bar, and so it moves down 10 ticks, it closes. Let's say it moves down three more ticks. And then from the low, it moves up 10 ticks from there. That's a new range bar. So a diagnostic bar uh, is infinitely more complex. But it goes in and it the way it plots, the market has to move X ticks in one direction for it to make a down close. And more ticks in a, another direction for it to have an up close so there's basically it's there's two different settings on a reversal ver that's why reversal bars are bigger than regular bars that's the simplest way i can put it um so i'm on a p3 14 day trial i downloaded the january 22nd toolkit update I loaded the template and it says, failed to validate feature trend catcher. Any ideas? Yep, you need to go to that link that I gave you and sign up to activate it, okay? So it doesn't just come with P3. Notice how we renamed it Essentials here to help differentiate the difference. You need to go to apexinvesting.net forward slash member forward slash sign up forward slash TC promo, okay? Activate that, then close and open Ninja and it should work just fine for you, okay? Um, you said trend catcher could work on stocks as well. How would that work? I, I, I hate personally trading stocks because the leverage is horrible. I mean, even with portfolio margining, having over 100 grand in an account, 15% or max risk with an option is the best you're getting. That's wretched. But if you like trading stocks for whatever reason, it'd work the exact same way. You just load it up, open it up, load on diagnostic bars, put on the settings and let it run. It wouldn't be any different. Um, if Nadex adds five minute binaries, will there be an additional charge for them? If you select the one adds more five minute binaries, they add more. Oh, you mean if they had more markets? I mean, we wouldn't charge you more for it. So, I mean, it's what it is. It comes with that. And then the apex pattern on those four effects. X pairs. So now, if you want to have if you want to have the apex pattern on more than those four FX pairs, then you need to go to elite. But um, we basically made it where you could use it on that for those five minute binary contracts. You don't have the other stuff though. But yeah, so I mean, they can add all the contracts they want. It doesn't mean you have to pay anything additional. Um, I currently have a P3 14 day trial. I'm interested in binary trading. Should I just place my emphasis on trading binary trend catcher program? Yes. Um, 
I'm probably going to go ahead and change out my three danger potions for Trend Catcher to keep the cost the same for now. Um, do you plan on adding more as time goes on? Do you mean more Trend Catcher or more day trading plans right now? We don't plan on adding additional markets at the moment because we, the amount of time we spend on them every night. Uh, plan on basically locking in at those eight. If I switch to day trading plans for Trend Catcher, can I add back day trading plans later for $100? I don't know what the price is going to be in the future. I don't know how many times, but yeah. Uh, I don't know what the price will be in the future, but yes, you can add them back on. But the price is what the price is right now. That's um, So the cut and case can be used if trading spreads, but the stats are not right. Well, if the stats are not right, then you can't really use it, right? Because you have premium, you have expirations, you have... You know, larger bid offers, which are going to impact those average ticks. Uh, if you have a smaller count and you're wanting to trade them and you're wanting to go for that dollar a tick, then trade many uh, FX at a dollar tick, 10,000 units at dollar FX. And that would be the best way to go down to a dollar a tick and trade it. Uh, I mean, the, the closest one you could get maybe is gold. You know, because it's a pip wide, one to two pips wide on the spread options. But uh, if you want to try to apply it to spreads, you can. But I'm just saying, like, it's not accounting for spread expirations and premium. Uh, I moved from the – if I move from the day trading point package – okay, so we already answered that one. Let's see, use five minutes and change ranges to 20 minutes. We'll change brick size, six for 20. So yeah, so watch, yeah, go there and hop on Lori's webinar. She can give you all the details. She's in the room all the time. Like, we're sure she's taking a nice long break this weekend, but she can help you out with that quite a bit. Uh, she says she uses the, basically everything's the same, but she just makes her brick size six for the 20 minute binaries during the day. So if you're watching the five minute binary course, she says keep everything the same. She actually helped us build the course. We went over it with her as well. Uh, wanted her input because she's doing it just as much. And uh, she's saying the one thing to change is just change it from three tick to six tick. Can I add the trick catcher to the existing template? You can add trick catcher to any template if you just right click and add the indicator. What is the name of the course for Trend Catcher? Not for Nadex or binary users, and where do I find it? That is, again, that is not done yet. That'll be done next Tuesday for Futures Forex, CFDs, and Stock Traders. Um, let's see here. And oh yeah, Scott, you're there. Awesome. Can you? update this YM one because it's the short version like something didn't get copied over um, is trend catcher disabled until we go through the course I just stopped in T cleared cash installed new Apex toolkit and it's still disabled so John if you're not and I don't mean this in, you, I don't, you got you got to use the link to activate it I mean that's really it so just sign up on the link then close and reopen Ninja, and it will work. Uh, if I send up a while ago before Trend Catcher came out, but I'm not a paying member as of now, could I still partake in the 14-day trial, continue paying the monthly fee? Yes, you can. Just right here on the home page. Hop on in, and just click right there. So choose which one you want. You know, futures, forks, spreads, CFDs, stocks, everything, or binaries. Go on binaries, click here. Spread click here, and you can access that right now with the seven-day trial. So if you were a previous member, you were to hop back in, you can try it out for seven bucks for 14 days. Um, then it'll continue on the monthly. Uh, when you're trading Forex and you mentioned tick bars, you're referring to pips. Yeah, pip, tick, it, they both mean smallest increment. So yes, they're synonymous, but yes, pip. Uh, a tick is a movement in a chart at its smallest increment. A pip is 
a pip actually can be smaller than that because it can actually go you know you can go to the extra decimal places so like a whole rounded you know pip tick but yeah I just use them interchangeably because they mean the same but yep you got it um Let's see here. Yeah, Kelly, that's something we're working on. It's not out there yet. Um, does this start at 1130? I'm sorry, I don't. I'm not quite sure what you mean on that. I probably just get into your question there. Um, is Trincatcher a separate subscription? If you already have... Elite MVP or P3, then you need to go to that link to activate the 30-day free trial. Okay? If you do nothing, then it will expire in 30 days. You can add it on. $400 if you're an Elite MVP with day trading plan or a P3 with day trading plan member. Or you can say, I'd rather have that than the day trading plans at no additional cost. Just let us know inside the help desk which one you would like to do. But right now, just go to the link, check it out, and get access to it. Day trading plan chart and trend catcher chart of same contract can't be on same chart. Is that correct? No, you can you can add a, you can add a hundred indicators on a chart. So you can put as much on one chart as you want to. Um, is trend catcher always in trading long or short all the time, or are there gaps where there are not valid trades? Yes, there are definitely gaps where there are not valid trades. It's not long or short all the time. So if you just turn the simulator on, you'll see where the trades happened based on the settings added in. Uh, can I add trend catcher to an existing template? Yep, just right click, click indicator, add it, put whatever settings you want in there, click OK, right click, and save the template. Uh, trading spreads is going to be challenging because, again, you have premium, you have expirations, you have... Uh, Wider bid offers, you can try it. I'm not going to put it on the recommended list at this point. I want to point you towards the best thing. Why worry about spreads when it has to move 20 ticks to get $20 when you can make $20 on two ticks of movement in two minutes? Uh, and I love spreads. Okay, don't get me wrong. I traded spreads for nine months before I ever touched a binary. So it's basically, they're basically options for day traders, what spreads are. They're call and put options for day traders. Uh, but 20 ticks for $20 minus three bucks for a bit of spread. Okay. Or two ticks and after bid offer spread, you're still up 20 bucks, which one, and, and you can do that 11 times an hour, maybe 12 times an hour, uh, potentially because every five minutes, uh, 30 days only applies to those who are currently paying members. If you are not a paying member, then just choose which trial you want. So it's basically people are already paying monthly or annually. That's what the free trial is for them to choose if they want to use that or day trading plans or add it on. If you choose these plans, it comes with it right now. The ones that are right here on the home page. If all the Apex members in the trade catcher and entering the same trades, if every single member entered the exact same trade at the exact same time on the market, some markets it would impact, some markets it wouldn't. But it would take a lot of traders trading the the same second. So we're big, but we're not that big. <laughs> so if anything, it should actually force the market because you're buy, 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 buy above the market. Um, is this designed to be automated? Nope. You have to sit there and push the button. Um. Is Trend Catcher enabled in the toolkit as of this moment for paid members because mine says disabled? Job, that's because you have not clicked on the link. Go to the link, click on it, fill out the form, and you will have access. Okay? Um, let's see here. Um, okay, well, we got volume. I guess you can't hear me, though. <laughs> um, I'm an annual P3 with day trading plan, and I'd like to be an annual elite with trend catcher and day trading plan. 
no problem. Just go ahead and let us know, and we'll send you the link to add on the $100 a month to add on the trend catcher. Um, how about if we want all the above? Elite package, day trading plan, trend catcher all together. Will that be 300 monthly or 400? That would be 400 because you'd be adding trend catcher on to the additional five day trading plans. So as a monthly member, that would be four. Um, when the settings are pasted in it, just for statistics, mostly correct. The settings are pasted in it. It's not just for uh, statistics. It's actually going to plot the trades live. Like it'll boom, red arrow. Then that blue line, as soon as it closes, will plot on the. So it will show. It'll live. It'll show entry and exits. So it's more than just statistics. It's actually the, all the settings that literally make it do what it does. Um. The latest toolkit is today's toolkit. So today is the, I mean, it's, it's the latest, when you open it, it's going to be the latest date. Yeah. Just whatever the way, I don't know what the date timestamp is going to be on it, but it's going to be the latest date in there. Um, let's see. Um, if I move from the day trading plan package to the current crunch package, will it be possible to move back? Yes, you can move back. What the cost will be at that time, I, I can't answer that because it, when are you moving back, right? So if it's six months from now, two years from now, one month from now, you know, um, it is possible. Um, confirmation bar types. Again, Kelly, that's a feature that is not, that we're testing right now. Okay? You're in alpha, remember? You see other stuff. Um, if you want to trade straddles, strangles on Nadex binaries, can you use the trend catcher to assist? Um, no. What you need to do if you want to trade that is you need to go over here and you need to watch the strangle and, well, you know, fix that butterfly error on menu. But right there, click that. But the trend catcher is about trends. Straddles and strangles are about not caring about the trend, just caring about movement. So you're going to use volume and expected ranges. So just go watch that strangle course right there. Okay, he'll teach you how to do that. Um, I'm an annual Elite Futures member, Elite MVP. Uh, you can either, what will I pay? Keith, you can either pay $100 a month and add it on to your day trading plans. Or you can just say, hey, I would just rather have Trend Catcher the day trading plans and you pay nothing extra. Okay, just let us know right here in the help desk. Uh, said you already have this product activated. Um, if you want to hop in the help desk, submit a ticket, we'll look right at your account and check it out. Just figure out what's up with that, okay? Um, if it says it's already activated, that should mean you have it. As funny as that sounds, right? It should say trend catcher 30 day promo. You may have to refresh or log out, log back in for it to update, but you should see it in there. Uh, but yeah, if you're not seeing it, let us know. I mean, we can go in and manually turn the button on for you too. Okay. So, yep. You can add on existing template. Can we expect additional five minute binary currency pairs soon? No, I don't think there's going to be additional pairs soon. I, I don't really care if they add more pairs because you can only keep up with so many. I would just like more size. So, which that, that I know is something that's in the works. Um, we might have also more strikes. Who knows? So, uh, I subscribed to the promo elite membership a couple weeks ago. You mean the trial if it was a couple weeks ago? Uh, but seems the Apex Essentials with Spider Trick is all I need. Does that want to start with five minute binaries? Is there any more of a profit advantage of using Elite MVP? Oh, for starting out and you're only going to trade binaries? Yeah, I mean, with the MVP, you do get some additional things um, that will help you out. You get Apex Pattern on a lot of different stuff. You get um, Choppy Market Warning that you can use. That's more advanced. Um, like, we sort of list off the differences over here. 
And if you want to trade to 20 minutes, like using six ticks, you can also do that uh, with the Apex pattern on it. So there, there are some things that you probably definitely want to hold on to there. Uh, you have that. So, but yeah, you definitely can combine systems. I mean, that's ideally where you want to go because Elite teaches you how to read the markets. So obviously we're making things get better. Okay. So, right, yeah, there's only four or five-minute binary contracts, so that's why there's only four that are enabled. Um, there you go. There's the link there for you. Do you want it? Um, what about strings Stringles on binary? Okay, so, yeah, doesn't assist with those. Any future plans for Nadex Bitcoin trading? Not really. They have daily contracts with a 20 size. You can't pull volume on it. It's based on an index. It's not like... It's based on an index that's made for institutional traders. You can't feed data in. I mean, we can go on and on and on, but... Just because something's new doesn't mean it's what I should trade. I got five-minute contracts. Why would I bother with a daily when in two ticks I can make more, I mean, take a massive move for me to make the same amount of money on a daily contract. So it's just sort of like, why? I mean, it's fascinating, it's cool, it's new, it's shiny, but there, like, is there an advantage to trading that instrument? Not really. Not, it didn't even come close. And even he's like, well, Bitcoin's really volatile. Yeah, but five-minute binaries are more volatile. Um, when you say option one, do nothing, the trend catcher trial will expire, and your plan will stay the same, does that mean the current elite member will continue to have the MVP, but without the trend catcher? Yes. So for current elite members, after the trial, the total elite cost will be whatever you're paying right now. You're, if you do nothing, you won't have to pay anything additional. Okay? You subscribe to the 30-day trial for free. Whatever you're paying right now, Rod, won't change. If you don't even do anything, it won't change. If you sign up for the 30-day trial, and you don't tell us to upgrade you, it won't change. Okay? So if you say, hey... Upgrade me, then of course it'd be a hundred dollars more a month. Or you can say, you know what, I don't want the like I'd rather have the add-on and not have the directory plans, and then there'd be no change. So whatever your cost is now, it won't change unless you say, add this on because I want to keep the day trading plans as well. I want I want the elite MVP, I want the trend catcher, and I want the day trading plans. Does that make sense? Um. Can you explain the A and E in the trend catcher? Yes, I can, and I spent all night. I literally didn't go to bed explaining it. I spent so much time. I spent, like, literally about, I don't know, what, 18 hours uh, putting this together, and I've already explained it for you. All you got to do is go watch that course, and I lay it all out for you piece by piece. <laughs> okay, is that fair? If I spent 14 hours doing it, you can, you know, go watch it. Like, it's worth it. Um so, yep, you can add it to a template. Do you think that trick catch would do well on four ticks at night, for example, on 6A? You don't have to think. You don't have to guess. You literally can just load it up and get the stats instantly. Um, that's what I love about it. It's like, I wonder if I just scalped or if I just use this tick size or you'll know in a quick. You don't have to... It's, don't have to be an opinion. Doesn't have to be like, oh, I just looked at a date. It looked great, so I think it's wonderful now. Like you literally can load it up, boom. Obviously, I mean, you don't need a year of data because markets change, volatility changes. You need to look at the last few months on a consistent basis. So yeah. Um, I tried to catch this morning. It was showing disabled. You know why, Brett? Because you hadn't filled out the link yet. <laughs> I don't know how many times I can say that one, guys. I'm sorry, but <laughs> you got to fill out the link because the link wasn't available this morning. So go fill that out. Close Ninja. Reopen it. It'll work. How much will it be to switch from P3 day trading promo plan to Trend Catcher Elite MVP? Nothing if you don't want the day trading plans. No difference in your cost. Um, oh, oh, wait a minute. P3 to Elite. Uh, that one you would need to submit in the help desk and we can work that out for you. Okay. So if you're, if you're on the P3 annual plan, you want to switch to the elite annual plan. What's the cost difference? So if you'll submit that in the help desk, we'll work that out. Okay. They'll figure out the, the math for you. 
Um, let's see here. I may not have heard your answer earlier. If you want the whole enchilada, elite, trend catcher, elite MVP, day trading plan. If you already have it, it'd be, well, it's $400. Yes, you're right. Um, and the five-minute binary trinket, so yeah, that's correct, Justin. Um, in the five-minute binary trend catcher course, do you show us absolutely the fastest way to enter the take profit after the original order buy and sell is executed? Yep, but you're going to have to watch it to find out. I mean, the fastest way, I mean, it's, yeah, I mean, just, just watch the course. <laughs> um, I promise I worked really hard on it to make it as easy as possible. Like, it's a lot, but it's, I, I, we really, really, really worked hard to make it, like, the best course we've ever made. Um. Your cards to winning minute binaries. If all you need is change the bar to six, does that mean that if all I get is the Apex Essentials membership, does the Apex pattern show up for the indices? No, it does not. It only shows up for the four FX pairs. So you'd need to pay the additional 50 to upgrade to Elite to get that. Um, that's one of the advantages of Elite over Essentials is... We had never actually never have made the Apex pattern available before for anything but the Elite membership. But for the binary contracts, and it was literally it's just one of the rules that's really helpful. And I'm like, we got to do this. So we added in those four. We've never offered it at all, ever. So we've added in those four. But if you want more than that, if you want eight, then you'll need the Elite. Um, but the five minutes will keep you busy. <laughs> okay. Um. Let's see here. I may not have heard. I've got that one covered. Fast. Got it. 20 minutes. Got it. Replay the webinar um, as soon as I can get it up. So, I mean, I'll render it and I'll load it to YouTube and it'll be up. So, um, I got, we're not going to sit on it for a week, right? So, basically, just got to load it up just however long it takes to render and upload. And then we got to post it in the forum and all that fun stuff in the recent webinars. How can a 10 tick, 10 minute bar and 12 tick diagnostic bar be on the same chart? That's the whole beauty of confirmation is it's going in and looking at it. So, Alan, what I was telling you is you could trade the diagnostic bars using the elite size. Okay. on the day trading plans. They're cleaner. Make the bar close in the direction of the entry. So if the market's flying up and you got to sell, wait until you get a down close on a diagnostic bar before you sell. So, or you can open two charts. But uh, the other way to do it is you could literally just, well, yeah, that's, that's how you do it. Either two charts or you would just use diagnostic bars. Um, let's see here. Next question. Uh, got that, got that. So I was away for a few minutes. Will there be templates for futures? There will be parameters. There won't be templates. You don't need it. It's right click, add indicator, right click, add indicator. Like this. And then you go to the parameters that are in the forum. Mike, yeah, exactly. So, yeah, to sign up, just, yeah, go with, you can hop on and get the 14 day trial right there. You got it. Um, how do you know the latest toolkit? Just open it up and it will show you the latest date available. No matter what, just install it. It takes seconds. So, just install it. If you're not sure, just install it. Um, is true IQ feed uses FXCM data for Forex? It is true, but they pipeline it a lot faster. Like a lot, a lot, a lot faster. Um, it is actually slower going through FXCM. 
So, because what you're paying for when you go to IQ feed is that speed. And then let's see. Uh, and we get Forex free with a basic membership if you use the IQ feed link. So make sure you use that. Like, we don't get paid anything on it, but Apex members, because we refer a lot of people over there, they get the Forex add on to the basic IQ feed data free if you want it. It's not required. Um,. Can't get settings to paste. Well, what you gotta do is you gotta highlight the text. Control C. No right click in here. Control C. Go to the parameters field. The third parameters field. Control V. Okay. Um, right now, to add it to the annual membership is a hundred dollars a month, or you can just get it free if you switch over. From victory plans to that. Right now, that's the only option. Um, I just loaded trend catcher dollar yen charts. Uh, that loaded from the template. Got the exact same stuff as listed inside of the Eston system. Sweet. Um, thank you, and all of you who worked, you're welcome. <laughs> thank you, John. Um, can I use Boomerang with Essentials? Yes, you can. Um, my recommendation, and Boomerang is awesome. Okay, like it teaches you how to read the markets, the ranges. really helps you master ranges. Massive value in that. I don't care what kind of trader you are. Just watching, especially those first few videos. Um, I would still focus on this first and then go to Boomerang second. But yes, you, can, you, you get volume. You get... Uh, basically, what you need for boomerang is you need expected volume and you need expected range. And so you get those with the essentials and the elite, both. All right. Well, I think I got all the questions. I'm going to do one last call. So I'll probably hurt myself here. One last call. But uh, did I get everybody's questions? If you have questions, you're not sure, you're trying to figure out the choice, how does this impact you? We don't want anybody out there confused. Just hop on and go to the help desk and just click submit a ticket and ask, and we will help you, okay? So, um, main thing is just hop on and get the trial going. We got four whole weeks. So, hop in there and take advantage of it. All right, y'all are welcome. So I hope you all have a great weekend, and uh, we'll see you all in the trading rooms on Monday. All right, you too.